Hey guys, it's Cheese, different setup because different type of video. Um, I just got back from Diskim. I am showing you guys a haul of the cheapest products you can find in Diskim. So your cheapest skincare products. I was looking for about like five to six products. So if I was looking for a cleanser, it has to be the cheapest cleanser that I can find in Diskim. And it was actually harder than I thought because I mean like I had to like cross reference and just some things are just like because mm -mm, some things were really going to tear up my skin. Hashtag walnut scrubs. Um, but yeah, it was interesting. So make sure to watch the whole video to see how it turned out so i'm on my way to this game and we are going to be doing a haul but we are doing the cheapest products in this game so cheapest skincare products hopefully they actually are cheap because i'm broke um so they need to be like cheap cheap and then i'll show you guys what i got i'm also going to show you guys what i'm in the store like trying to find the products hopefully it's open because today's also just like public holiday and now i'm just wasting my time and it's actually closed and yeah, then the next video I will be using the products. So it should be interesting. Hopefully I don't break out. Hopefully the cheapest products are like skin bleaching products or like just like hazardous tearing up my skin products. But it's an adventure. Okay, we are here. I thought it would be quieter, but it's not. Uh, L'Oreal, this is definitely the cheaper aisle, but I feel like this is still pricey. We need to get to these moments here okay so we're here in the aisles I'm seeing some things I actually want to try but they're not part of the video like I've never seen this whatever this is I want to try it but not today not today focus so first up let's look for cleansers into magic but I mean those prices are just that is affordable but i don't want to stick to the same brand so i'll get something from here let's go for a is that a serum i've never seen a serum like this okay it's a moisturizer serum okay so choose one from each brand so that it's like different the things that i would not be getting these things right here no, because of that alcohol in it like I'm not trying to I'm actually not trying to ruin my skin for the sake of the video um, so maybe the soap because I don't know I don't know I don't know hey is this worth it is this worth is this worth views Ooh, hoo, hoo. okay into magic cleansing soap bar interesting I can't find like an affordable cleansing oil they're all like above a hundred bucks I'm trying to be like go like super cheap um, so I might just cut that out exfoliator um, so all the affordable ones or like the cheapest ones are like the abrasive ones which I'm not too keen for so so far I'm seeing this by Garnier this is 49 let's see if I can find a cheap one okay so the discount brand nature's nourishment seems to be cheaper it's 45.95 robos vitamin E and tea tree the robots. Hopefully it doesn't tear me up. Okay, false alarm. I found an even cheaper one. I don't know if you guys have heard of this. QT Cura. This, I don't know. Anyway, it is $34.95. So, that's the winner. It's the winner for tearing up my skin. Okay, now I need a moisturizer. From the Discount brand, vitamin, the Nature's Natural Vitamin E. Oh, that's a night cream. I don't need that. The day cream is 55 bucks. Okay, let's see if I can find something cheaper. I don't think so. This is actually cheaper. Garnier, a brand we know. Ooh, very oily, normal to dry, normal to oily. Let's go for normal to dry because that's what I'm going through. 39.95 that's the cheapest can't recording people just keep coming into my aisle can we just stay away for today please thank you this one 119.95 which one is it though this is the spf 30 is 119.95 you know i like a 50 we'll take the 30 for now 119 okay so this is 129 for a serum, which is quite cheap. Oh, Neutrogena 127. Oh, but these are pricey. Nice specials. Oh, here's one. 
Saltone SPF 30, $89.95. That's the winner. So I'm just gonna drop this one off. I can't remember how much it was, but it was oh it was one one nine. So yeah. Thank you. Bye. TTYN turn me into like just like mayonnaise. Just white. Um Casper. Four for three fifty eight ten. Not bad. Um, yeah, not bad. Okay, so we are back. These are the goodies. Got okay. The packet looks a bit thin on camera. I mean, it doesn't look like much for a haul. But there are how many products? Two, four, six products. So like a full skincare routine. Let me show you guys what I got. Okay, so first up, I was looking for a cleanser. I couldn't find an oil cleanser that was like affordable, so I just let that go. Um, but I was like, let me try something. I always see this Gentle Magic, and they have this skincare soap bar. I don't, I'm not really a fan of using bars like for my face, because I just feel like they're getting contaminated while they're just drying up there on the soap dish. Do we even still have soap dishes? Special Gliss, Glycine, Glycine wrapped bar. Is that meant to be glycerine? I don't know. Anyway, so it looks like this, and you're just gonna wash it onto your face. My next video, I'll show my actual routine with the with the products. That should be interesting. Doesn't smell bad. It actually, smells quite nice. Oh, there's my Uber Eats here. Oh, she is hungry. And then next, I went for I was looking for an exfoliator. You guys know that I prefer using chemical exfoliators. This is my on, um, but I couldn't find one. And the cheapest one that I could find was this brand. Cutie Cura, I've never heard of it before. It just says scrub, so scrub. Exfoliates and moisturizes. It's a face scrub. Um, jojoba oil and herbal extract. So yeah, this is one of those scrubs that's gonna have like granules. Yes, there we go. In it, usually I don't like those because um, they can be quite vicious, but I mean, we'll try it out. We'll just have to like rub gently. I got a mask. So like let me try it out. I always see Himalaya herbals and people always like comment about it and ask about it. So I was like, let me try it out. It was an affordable face mask. This is a refreshing fruit mask with papaya and apple extract. Deep cleanses, firms and rejuvenates. Um, it's a cooling mask that clears clogged pores and blackheads, impurities, all that stuff. Apple, a rich source of natural HAs. Okay, that's good to know. And now she's an improves glow. Fig and cucumber. Okay, there's a lot going on here. So normally I don't go for like these clay type of masks. Um, I normally prefer like a sheet mask or something like that. Something like more hydrating. But I was like, you know what? Let me try it. This brand has been around, so I'm sure it does what it needs to do. I got a serum. So serums are usually quite expensive, but now now you're getting like more and more serums in um, your drugstores and your pharmacies. And this is by Neutrogena, the Hydro Boost. I feel like I'm so close to the camera. Uh, this is their capsule in serum, supercharged booster, hyaluronic acid and vitamin E capsules. You know we love hyaluronic acid. So this, I'm actually look, I've actually always wanted to try this, so I'm actually glad it was the cheapest serum I could find. And this is really gonna hydrate and just moisturize my skin. Ooh, let me just actually just do a pump over here. I'm also checking on my Uber Eats. Okay, so a pump. Yes, okay, I'm, I feel like I'm gonna love this thing. I don't know, but I just feel like we are gonna be friends. I'll be back. Okay, I got my food, yes. And then next up is my moisturizer. So I was surprised that I was surprised that this ended up being the most affordable. And this is by Garnier Skin Active. It's the even and matte ideal complexion daily cream I never really used Garnier the only thing I've got is that um, micellar water and yeah so there were lots of like random brands in the store but this ended up being the most affordable moisturizer which is which I was surprised because it's like a big brand and let's see it's got pure lemon essence I'm guessing that's for the complexion and hydrating glycerin moisturizing so I went for the normal to dry skin one there are a few different versions and it's meant to give you 24 hour moisture. I don't know about that, but I'm sure it'll give me some moisture. Let's rub it on and see how see how that feels. Okay, 
it. Takes some time to absorb, but that's fine, it gets there. Does this have SPF? It does not. Okay, that's fine, that's fine, because you know I always talk about my SPF, so I was just, just, just checking, asking for a friend. Um, yeah, so, it feels okay on the skin. It is like, killing. So giving those like low balls. I don't know if that's because of the serum I put underneath, but we'll see when it's on the face. You see, if I rub hard, you can see it's. Oh, ah, ah, ah. No, that didn't move. That didn't move. I hope, it, but okay. Um, and then, last but not least, because it's the most important. If you are not doing this, you you just playing games with your life. I think. I don't know. Um, yeah, I mean, we're not friends. Anyway, it's sunscreen. We always need sunscreen. This is SPF 30. Normally I like a 50, but 30 is fine. 30 is perfectly okay. It's got um, UVA and UVB. This is by Saltone. So I've actually seen this brand before. And it's a sunscreen SPF 30. It's got UVA and UVB. Very important. It's mattifying for acne prone skin. I don't have acne prone skin, but we can make it work. It says non-whitening formulation. We'll see about that. Let's see if it does the white thing, because if it does, oof. This is probably the one I'm most scared of. And by no means am I saying that like expensive products are always great, because some expensive sunscreens will also make you turn into Casper. Because I actually want like products that I'll like from this and maybe just switch to and save some coins. Okay, so let's rub that in. This. Okay, it's actually, it's actually not bad. It's not bad. It's actually absorbing into the skin. Okay, that was actually. Oh man. Okay. Okay. And this was how. This is nice, man. This was ninety bucks, eighty nine ninety five. If this actually like lasts like this and like stays on like this, I would actually switch to this. Forget these expensive brands, just stealing all my money. Um, here's the receipt. Everything came to 358 10 cents. 358 Rand and 10 cents, which is not bad for like a full a full on routine. I mean, I don't know how the routine will be and how my skin will be, but there's some products in there that are, you know. The sunscreen actually just changed my life. Make sure you tune to the next video to see how these actually go down. So let me know in the comments below which product you're most looking forward to me trying on, which ones you have tried on, and yeah, let's see if these are actually popping. Let's see if we can switch to these products and just, you know, all, I'm all about saving my coins, guys. I think because I've been broke like recently for like too long, so I just need my coins. Yeah, anyway, that's a story for another time. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please make sure to tune into my next video and here are some other videos for you guys to watch. Please make sure to hit the thumbs up button, the subscribe button, and the notification bell so you don't miss any posts. My name is Cheats, coming to you with all your African skincare and beauty tips. Hope you guys have a good day. Bye.